What's up, UC Irvine? She is a powerful Democratic voice from New York who came to UC Irvine Sunday to reach students and support local candidates and democracy. Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez, in her own words about the January 6th insurrection. There is no person that seeks to prevent the peaceful transition of power in the United States of America that can also call themselves a patriot. A very long answer to a complicated question. On the campus of UC San Diego this afternoon, San Diego Superior Court candidate Rebecca Cantor was one of several local candidates bringing their campaign message straight to a town hall meeting with students. The overwhelming majority of students are not registered to vote, and that's something we're trying to change here. Daniel Soria is a UCSD sophomore studying political science and international affairs. He's also a student government leader working to educate more of his classmates. We're trying to bridge the gap um, between student political initiatives and those addressed by our politicians here in the greater San Diego area. We're also trying to make sure that UCSD students know who's running for office in the districts they live in. Before you can vote, you have to be registered, and the clock has just about run out on that. Today is the official deadline to register to vote in the November election, but it is not the last opportunity. Thank you for voting. Have a good day. Ballots are being dropped off and last minute registrations are being taken here at the San Diego County Registrar of Voters Office. Starting Saturday, you can still register conditionally and vote provisionally at any county voting center. Provisional voting means that your ballot goes inside an envelope and once we verify your registration and verify that you didn't vote elsewhere in the state, then we will count that ballot. Dora Crockett has been registered to vote since she was 17 years old. She has a stern message for those who have still not registered. I say shame on you. Get out and register to vote. We need your vote to make a change. Our democracy is being challenged and we need you to get out and vote. Turn out for Katie Porter! Tough words for a tough election season. M.G. Perez, KPBS News.